Hey Geography Peeps, this is going to be a special episode of Geography More because we're going to do something a little different. A lot of you guys have actually requested that we cover some key attributes of countries that we actually typically don't really cover much in the episodes. I'm talking about currency, plug outlets, some of the main airports with their IATA codes, the national animal, and what side of the road that countries drive on. So I'm going to go back all the way to Afghanistan and halfway through I got a special announcement for you guys. At the very end I will mention which countries drive on the left side of the road and you can just assume everything that was not mentioned drives on the right side because there's more countries that drive on the right side. Cool. All right, let's jump in. For Afghanistan, the currency is the Afghani and the subunit being the pool. They use the C and F outlets. Major airports include Kabul Hamid Karzai International as well as Kandahar International. The national animal is the snow leopard. Albania, the currency is the Lek subdivided into Kindarke. They use the C and F outlets. The main international airport being Tirana Nene Teresa or Mother Teresa International. And the national animal is the golden eagle. Algeria, they use dinars and centimes. The C and F outlet. Major airports include Suman Abane Ramdan. Dane Bejaya Airport, as well as Huari Boumedina Algiers Airport. The national animal is the fennec fox. Andorra uses euros, which is divided into cents. They also use the C and F outlets. Now, Andorra doesn't have any airports. However, they did just recently build the La Seu d'Urgel Airport in Catalonia, Spain, which is kind of close to Andorra, and it was actually built there specifically for the purpose to accommodate people to go to Andorra, even though it's in Spain. Otherwise, to get there, you're either going to have to fly to Toulouse, France, or Barcelona, Spain, which are each about two hours of a drive away from Andorra. However, there is a train that goes to Los Palitet in France, which is only like three kilometers away from the Andorran border. So that's like your best bet. And they don't actually have a national animal. Some will say it's the bull because it's on the flag and the coat of arms. And some will say it's the bearded vulture, but eh, up for grabs. Angola uses the Kwanzaa and the Centimo. They use the sea outlet. Major airports include Luanda Cuatro de Febrero International and Albano Machado Huambo Airport. And the animal is the red crested Turaco. Antigua and Barbuda. The country uses the East Caribbean dollar, which is subdivided into cents. They use the A a and B outlets at 60 hertz. The major international airport is Antigua VC Bird International, and they have three national animals, one for land, air, and sea, the frigate bird, the hawksbill turtle, and the fallow deer. Argentina uses the pesos and the centavos. They use the C outlet. Major airports include two for Buenos Aires, Ministro Pistarini, and Jorge Newberry. There's Cordoba International, or Ingeniero Aeronautico Ambrosio LV Taravea International, and the national animal is the Rufos Orneo. Armenia. The currency is the drum, which is divided into Lumas. Major airports include Yerevan Svartnats International and Gyumri Shirak. The national animal is the eagle. Australia. They use the Australian dollar and cents. They use the eye plug outlet. Major airports include Sydney Kingsford Smith, Melbourne Tula Marine, Brisbane International, Perth International, and the national animals are the red kangaroo and the emu. Austria uses the euro and cents. They use the CF outlets. Major airports include Vienna International, Salzburg, and Graz International, and the national animal is the black eagle. Azerbaijan. They use the Manat, which is divided into Kepik. They use the Sea Outlet. Major airports include Baku Haydar Aliyev International and Ganya International. The national animal is the Karabakh Horse. Bahamas. They use the Bahamian Dollar and Cents. They use the A and B Outlets at 60 Hertz. Major airports include Nassau Linden Pinling International, Exuma International, Grand Bahama Freeport, although that's kind of like a private airport that only really rich people go to. And the national animal is the Blue Martin and Flamingo. Bahrain. They use the dinar, which is divided into fills. They use the G outlet. The one major airport is Bahrain International, and the national animal is the white oryx. Bangladesh. They use the taka, divided into poisha. They use the C, D, and G, and K outlets. Major airports include Dhaka Shah Jalal, Chittagong Shah Amanat, and the national animals are the Bengal tiger and magpie robin. Barbados. They use the Barbadian dollar and cents. They use the A and B outlets. The one major airport is Sewell Grantley Adams International, and the national animal is the flying fish and pelican. Belarus. They use the ruble and the kapieka. They use the C and F outlets. Major airports are Minsk International and Gomel International. And the national animal is the European bison. Belgium. They use the euro and cents. They use the C and E outlets. Major airports are Brussels, which has two Brussels International and South Brussels Charlois, as well as Antwerp International. The national animal is the lion. Belize. They use the Belizean dollar and cents. They use the A, B, and G outlets at 60 hertz. The one major international airport is Belize City Philip S. W. Goldson International, and the national animal is the Baird's Taper. Benin. They use the West African CPA franc, which is divided into centimes. They use the C and E outlets. The major international airport is Cotonou Kajahun International. <laughs> the acronym is KU. And the national animal is the leopard. Bhutan. They use the Ngultrum and the Chetrum, but they also use Indian rupees as well. It's kind of like a dual currency country. They use the C, D, F, G, and 
and M outlets. Whew. The one major international airport is Paro Airport, and the national animal is Druk the Dragon and the rare Takin. All right, so now we're gonna take a little break because I got a little special announcement for you guys. I have been waiting for these people to contact Geography Now for so long, and they finally did, and I'm so excited to announce that Geography Now is now sponsored by Audible. You know that a YouTube channel is pretty legit when Audible decides to sponsor them. So Audible reached out and they are finally helping us out, so that's awesome. For those of you who don't know, Audible is a great website where you can not only just get audio books, which I thought that was all they could do, but no, you could also get like TV shows and a bunch of other cool stuff as well. So check out audible.com. And if you use the link to audible.com slash geography, you can get a free 30 day trial. So uh, check that out. One great book that I've actually been listening to and I've really liked was Map Head by Ken Jennings. I don't know if you guys remember, but Ken Jennings was that guy who was like on Jeopardy for like so many months and he won like $2 million because he couldn't get, just nobody could beat him. So the genius guy, he wrote a book. It's called Map Head. Totally recommend it. Go to Audible. Love Audible. Thank you so much, Audible. Anywho, let's get back. Bolivia uses the Bolivianos, which is divided into centavos. They use the A and C outlets. Major airports include La Paz El Alto International and Santa Cruz de la Sierra Viru Viru International. And the national animal is the condor and the llama. Llama, llama, yeah, same thing. Bosnia and Herzegovina. They use the convertible mark, which is divided into fennings. They use the C and F outlets. Some major airports are Sarajevo International and Banja Luka International. Now they don't really have a national animal, however the Bosnian golden lily is kind of like the national plant slash flower which is seen everywhere. And also some people will say that the Tornjak shepherd dog is probably like the national animal because it's native to the area. So maybe you could say that. Botswana. They use the Pula which is divided into Thebe. They use the D, G, and M outlets. Major airports include Gabarones Sirserece Kama International and Maun International Airport. The national animal is the zebra, however they do have a bull on their coat of arms that looks surprisingly close to the Chicago Bulls mascot. You know, I'm, I'm just saying. Brazil. They use the Real divided into centavos. They use the C and N outlets at 60 hertz. Major airports include Barulos International at Sao Paulo, Presidente Juscelino Kubitschek International at Brasilia, Galau or Antonio Carlos Jobim International Airport at Rio de Janeiro. The national animal is the Jaguar. Brunei uses the Bruneian dollar divided into sen. However, they do have a monetary agreement with Singapore and you can also use Singaporean dollars in the country as well. They use the G outlet. The one major international airport is Brunei International. The national animal is the white-bellied sea eagle. Bulgaria. They use the Lev, which is divided into Stotinka. They use the C and F outlets. Major airports are Sofia International and Burgas International. The national animal is the lion. Burkina Faso. They use the West African CPA franc divided into centim. They use the C and E outlets. Major airports include Bobo Dialasso International. <laughs> Boy. And Wagadugu International. The national animal is the white stallion. Remember, these guys are the cowboys of Africa. Burundi uses the Burundian franc, which is divided into centim. They use the C and E outlets. The one major international airport is Bujumbura International, and the national animal is the lion. Cambodia uses the Riel divided into Sen. They use the A, C, and G outlets. Major airports include Phnom Penh International and Siem Reap. The national animal is the Coupre bovine. Cameroon uses the Central African Franc and Centim. They use the C and E outlets. Major airports include Douala International and Yaoundé and Simalan International. The national animal is the lion. Canada uses Canadian dollars and cents. They use the A, B outlet at 60 hertz. Major airports are Toronto Pearson International, Vancouver, Calgary, and Montreal International. The national animal is the North American beaver, and it's not exactly official, but some people will also say the moose. Cape Verde uses the Escudo and Centavo. They use the C and F outlets. Major airports are Praia Nelson Mandela International and Sal Amilcar Cabral International. There's technically no national animal, but everybody knows that warblers, swifts, and wall geckos are everywhere. The Central African Republic uses the Central African Franc and Centim. They use the C and E outlets. The one major international airport is Bangui Mpoko International. The national animal is the African elephant. Chad also uses the Central African Franc and Centim. They use the C, D, E, and F outlets. The one major airport is N'Djamena International, and their national animal is the hippopotamus. Chile uses the peso and centavo. They use the C and L outlets. Major airports include Santiago, Comodoro, Arturo, Merni, Benitez International, Concepcion, Carrial Sur International. The national animal is the hemul or South Andean deer. China uses the yuan divided into fen. They use the A, I, and C outlets. Two airports in Shanghai, Pudong and Hongqiao. Guangzhou, Bayou, 
Kowloon, and of course the special administrative regions Hong Kong Chek Lap Kok International and Macau International. National animals are the giant panda and the red crowned crane. Colombia uses the peso divided into centavo. They use the A and B outlets at 60 hertz. Major airports are Bogota El Dorado, Medellin Jose Maria Cordova International, Cali Alfonso Bonilla Aragon International. National animal is the Andean condor and the true parrot. Comoros uses the Comoran franc, which looks amazing, divided into centim. They use the C and E outlets. The one major airport is Hahaya Prince Said Ibrahim International. The national animal is the lion. However, some people might say the bush pig as well. The Democratic Republic of Congo uses the Congolese franc and centim. They use the C, D, and E outlets. Major airports include Njili Airport and Kisangani Bangoka. The national animal is the okapi. The Republic of Congo uses the Central African franc and centim. They use the C, D, and E outlets. Major airports are Brazzaville Maya Maya International and Point Noir International. The national animal is the African elephant. Costa Rica uses the Colon and Centimo. They use the A and B outlets at 60 hertz. Major airports are San Jose Juan Santa Maria International and Liberia Daniel Udu Burkiros International. The national animals are the Yawiro bird and the West Indian manatee. Croatia uses the Kuna divided into Lipa. They use the C and F outlets. Major airports are Zagreb Franjo Tudman International, Dubrovnik Chilipi International, and Split Resnik International. The national animal is the Pine Martin. Cuba is strange because they have two currencies. They have the peso and the convertible peso, and it's weird because one is like valued a lot higher than the other, but it's you can't use it that much. It's whatever. That's how they do it. Divided into centavos, they use the A, B, and C at 60 hertz. Major airports are Havana Jose Marti International, Santiago de Cuba Antonia Maceo International, and Camagüey Ignacio Agramonte. The national animal is the trogon bird. Cyprus uses the euro. They use the G outlet. Major airports are Larnaca, Paphos, and Erjan International. The national animal is the Cypriot Muflon. The Czech Republic uses the Corona divided into Halerj. They use the C and E outlets. Major airports are Prague Vaclav Havel International and Brno Turjani International. The national animal is a double-tailed lion, which is a mythical creature. I mean, unless somebody discovers a mutated lion with a birth defect and they have two tails. Denmark uses the Kron and the Ur. They use the C, E, F, and K outlets. Major airports are Copenhagen Lufthavn Kastrup International, Billund International, which is mostly famous because, you know, Legoland. The national animal is the mute swan and tortoise shell butterfly. Djibouti uses the Djiboutian franc and centim. They use the C and E outlets. The one major airport is Djibouti Ambuli International. And they don't have a national animal, but some will say that the Bera antelope or the dugong are national animals. And eh, kind of. Dominica uses the East Caribbean dollar and cents. They use the D and G outlets. The one major airport is Douglas Charles International. The national animal is the Cicero parrot. The Dominican Republic uses Dominican pesos and centavos. They use the A and B outlets. Major airports are Punta Cana International, Santo Domingo Las Americas International. And the national animal is the palm chat bird. East Timor uses the US dollar and cents as well as centavo. They use the C, E, F, and I outlets. The one major airport is Dili Presidente Nicolau Lobato International. The national animal is the crocodile. Ecuador uses the US dollar and centavo. They use the A and B outlets at 60 hertz. Major airports are Quito Mariscal Sucre International and Guayaquil Jose Joaquin de Lomeldo International. The national animal is the Andean condor. Egypt uses the Egyptian pound divided into piastre. They use the C and F outlets. Major airports are Cairo International, Hergada International, and Sharm El Sheikh International. The national animal is the steppe eagle. El Salvador uses the US dollar. They use the A and B outlets at 60 hertz. The one major airport is San Salvador Comalapa International. The national animal is the turquoise browned momot bird. Whew, okay, so now out of all the countries we talked about, every single one of them drives on the right side except for these. Antigua and Barbuda, Australia, Bahamas, Bangladesh, Barbados, Bhutan, Botswana, Brunei, Cyprus, and Dominica. And that is it. Ah, oh, we finished over 50 countries. So I stopped at El Salvador because that's the most recent episode that we already filmed that I know for sure that I didn't put that information in. So after El Salvador, I will include these pieces of information in every episode. Thank you so much for watching this special episode of Geography More. A lot of good stuff coming up for the rest of this summer and fall and winter and next year and forever long this whole geography thing will take. So thank you for your, thank you for your dedication. All right, bye.